Sorry. The nicest and best grocery shop here in Malacca. Hello and welcome to another video here from Malacca. I'm Reinhard, behind the camera is Christine. And today we are at the newly opened grocery shop, the Chaya Grossa. In this area, it's very much developing. There are a lot of shops here, McDonald's, Coffee Bean, Burger King, Uniqlo, and one of our favorite food courts, Dietenk Paradise, the food court. And there are also a few other shops, uh, which uh, I think will open soon. No idea what it will be, but definitely I can say this area is uh, coming, is a trending area. But we are not here today to show you the environment. Today we want to show you this grocery shop, what you can expect there from local food, also to some imported food. We will walk you through that you get an impression. It's very crowded here. Yesterday we came in the evening with the motorbike. Okay. I tell you, no parking. No parking at all, many people, the crowds here. Maybe not today to buy here something. <laughs> so we will grab our trolley, our basket, and go in and walk around a bit uh, through the corridors. Come. It's going to rain later. Yeah, it's going to rain. Let's go in and buy something. Immediately after you enter the shop, you are at the vegetables area and it looks already very presentable. There are already very fresh and green and uh, colorful vegetables. Next, actually we wanted to explore a bit more the vegetable areas, but Christine was very determined to go already to one of the corridors because she was looking for a special product. I just followed her, which was also not so easy. The corridors, they are so narrow and there are a lot of movements because the stuff is continuously also stocking up everything in the shelves, on the shelves. After I was able to follow Christine, then uh, I think she did not find what she wanted to have and uh, that was not maybe the best start into this uh, <laughs> shopping experience. Yeah, I know what I'm looking for, I don't need to keep asking. Maybe they don't have it here. Tell me what you're... But what is it what you're looking for? Anyway, we had to move on and our next stop was uh, back to the vegetable areas. Special vegetables they have here. Ha! Any special vegetables? Can you don't block everyone here? No, no, you, you just go first then. We have seen a few products which maybe you don't find at other grocery avocado stores, based. which is yeah. maybe an avocado based. Yeah. And uh, what I personally did not like is that most of the vegetables, if it's uh, apples, berries, uh, whatever you can think of, is all packed in plastic. I don't like it and I think that's not so good for the environment. Anyway, after the vegetable areas, uh, we moved on to the first corridor. So the first corridor. Uh, nacho chips, jalapeno... Blah, blah, blah. There is uh, some of the deep frozen one and then there's also salmon. We bought before there, actually very nice the salmon. And uh, then there's an open area for seafood where you can get some fish or some prawns. And uh, in the next section there is also meat. And uh, if you want to go for something a bit more special, then maybe you go for the vario beef which, on the other hand, also the price was a bit shocking. 250 plus for a piece of steak, which maybe I will not buy. Moving on, Very Christine has seen some gem. famous peanut, uh, butter. peanut butter. And uh, then yeah, we moved to the next corridor. We have nothing in the basket yet. Eh? <laughs> Let's see if anything special, what uh, I think here all the muesli. What muesli? It's all organic. Okay. Right then. After we walked through the second corridor, we approached immediately the third one. So yeah. now it gets again difficult here. Traffic jam. Jam, jam, jam. Here are sauces, the, condiments, the rice, cooking oil and local vinegar. delight. Sauerkraut. We also found a mm -hmm. few very special products, uh, which usually you maybe right get here. only in Germany or Austria. Ah, yeah. It's called sauerkraut, which uh, one of my colleagues also very like much like. Kenny, you can get wow. sauerkraut here. Oh, ja. Barbecue sauce. It's Korean. Also Korean. It's all Korean. Ah, okay. Yeah, I see the name. Okay, let's see. See all the snacks. 
In general, you find also a lot of promotions uh, when you walk through. Maybe it's uh, during the opening. They want to promote a lot of products. Uh, there was also one tea you could taste and uh, Christine was uh, tasting it. I don't know why I did not get one. Maybe Christine did not want to share. Why don't you drink the green tea just now? Yeah. You did not offer me any. Yeah, he was you just ask he was too stingy. He thought you will. No. He thought you will give me some, but at the end you, you did. See the at the end you let. That's why I said, hey, you will drink, and then you never give me. You never see one. Nothing what I need here. Ah, uh, maybe I need some. We have a lot of candy. And every time you buy it, just keep it in the bag until it expires. <laughs> and uh, for the chocolate, yeah. you also get one. some chocolate, which is from Europe. That's original. Yeah. Do you know this one? We always eat the popcorn that I bought. Yeah, if they have the popcorn. Ricola. Biscuit. Snacks, snacks, snacks. Rita Sport. No, we got a combination of Linde. Continue. You need to look for the chips. You want wasabi? Maybe we try. I don't like wasabi. I try. You eat it. And moving forward uh, at the milk, dairy and uh, also the cheese area, you find also a bit more of the unique ones like uh, mozzarella balls, which actually we like a lot with some tomato salad, but uh, the price was quite uh, pricey. That's uh, why we did not buy them. Then what else we had? Okay. Some uh, beer promotion, buy a uh, ginger beer and uh, get a free bag then at the cashier. And uh, there's one non-halal area which we will not visit today. They have here also very good sausages and alcohol beverages. They have also one of the counters where you can get uh, meat and uh, ham and so on. Yeah, but finally then, as the crowd was very big on that day, we went then to the cashier. We went for the self-checkout kiosk and uh, I proved again how well I am with scanning all the barcodes and uh, annoyed Christine another time. Ah, is there also outside any? Here! <laughs> Balsamico! Very fast. Yeah, I'm a very fast talkkeeper then. Before, at the end of the day, then I made the payment and we went out. And uh, yes, here comes our final conclusion. Final thoughts? What do you like the most uh, in this grocery shop here? Mostly everything. <laughs> I like the most the variety also of some uh, different, uh, I would say. Uh, because it's the best, the giant grocer is like more variety than Aeon and then yeah I think you got an impression of the Chaya Grossa and uh, leave us a like and a comment if you also went already to this uh, Grossa Chaya Grossa all right bye bye did you just say I'm a joke <laughs> yeah we beat it now and the camera was off you said I'm a joke oh, yeah. oh. let's go a bit further and then we fly the drone Come in.